This short film has been made for all those who have given help to support two schools in Eritrea, at Sheeb in the mountains and Bogu in the valley below. Because the steep road up the mountain is so bad, we couldn't film in Sheeb. But we did renovate the broken school solar power system. However, most of this is filmed in Bogu, where even so, as you see, we had to walk the last mile up the dirt track. Our film shows something of how, thanks to the help of hundreds, we've been able to extend solar power in Bogu from a previous scheme some of you supported. Now there's light in all the teachers' homes and in more classrooms. We've also put in pit latrines. And the children will now be able to participate in local sports leagues since football and volleyball facilities are being installed along with plenty of equipment to play the games. My name is Tamit Asfai. I'm the director of Hume Salaba. And a few years ago, the solar power in your school broke down, didn't mm. it? Yeah. So we are um, bringing you today yeah. the uh, parts to repair it. Unfortunately, we can't go up the hill because it's very steep. So Tiami will go with the technician on a truck. But maybe you can explain to people back in England yeah. how it will help the school if we are able to uh, restore the solar power today. Yeah, thank you. Uh, the solar power is very uh, confidential in our area uh, because we don't have light power, I mean power or light there. So we are using the solar for different uh, powers, especially the demonstration room, library and night school. So we want to uh, thank us, many thanks to those who helped us to be repaired. And also you will have television back, yeah, won't you? Television, and a computer yeah, working computer. again. Everything works through this uh, uh, solar. Okay, this field behind me is at present growing groundnuts. But the community has agreed that is after the groundnuts have been harvested, because all the land belongs to the whole community, they will donate this field to be the football field for Bogu School. It's just behind the school. As you can see, it's nice and flat. And the children will help flatten it more. And then we are already having the football posts, both big ones and small ones made. And we have brought lots of footballs. And there will also be a volleyball court. And this will be the new sports ground to prepare the Ronaldos of Eritrea. My name is Samuel Tasfagabr. I have been for four years as a school director here. And our school is, is called Bogu Elementary and Junior School. And now at this moment he holds uh, 530 students and 17 teachers. We have been working for some time in cooperation with Bogle School and also in memory of John Holmes. So we are making this film to show John's friends about Bogle School and why he liked it so much. So can you explain some of the things that uh, the people who have given money for the school have been able to help with? Before two years, Dr. John Holmes and his friends cooperated with this school and they helped us for the solar, solar, TV, tape, and the video camera, and the dish. And all these have the people here and motivated us to do work. And in addition to this, they help, helped us in teaching learning facilities, how to the methodology of teaching. And then, from this time, all the teachers improve their teaching styles. This is a great contribution to our school. And the, now, at this time today, also they add solar and some toilets, and the, they have also programs for the families. This is a great problem for us, and the people, students, teachers, all are happy. Many of you who have supported this project have done so because you were friends of John Holmes, who dearly loved education, Eritrea and Bogu school. The villagers in Bogu also loved him. When they learned that John had died, no one went to the fields for three days and the school was closed for a similar time. When I went back to Bogu this August, the villagers had prepared a site where we planted eight trees in John's memory and we're having a small plaque made to go in the grove which will commemorate him in English, Tigrinya and the village language of Bilan. Okay, we had planned to come together this year to visit you and to install the extra 
solar power for the teachers and the football pitch that we hope will be going soon and to discuss how we can work together and see the progress of this of this place. I got sick very suddenly but uh, even in his last days he was asking me about coming to Bogu and many of his friends wanted to give some money to for something that he loved so they gave it to me to bring to Bogu. You may not know but John was very keen on digging in his garden so to plant trees for John would be a very thing he would love very much. He would think it was very good. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. We intend to continue working with Bogu School. Our next project is to raise money for a 50 barrel tank so there can be a ready supply of water for staff and students. We will be back.